In the event that you have rhesus, Rh, negative blood you may have a place with the nephilim, a parallel race to us people. Late investigations have demonstrated that this uncommon blood gathering may show non-human attributes in your cosmetics which set you apart from the regular DNA of Homo sapiens. There is a great deal of perplexity about the starting point of the word Nephilim and what it implies. In Hebrew it actually intends to fall. As in fallen heavenly attendant. The Bible, the Talmud and the Quran, where they are alluded to as jinn, all discuss fallen angels. In the book of Genesis in the Bible it relates how the Nephilim delivered youngsters with people. One was even delineated as slaughtering Japheth, Noah's child, and having his spot whereupon he fathered numerous kids with Japheth's clueless spouse which in the long run populated quite a bit of northern Europe. Specialists can't concur about where the inception of this side request of people may have begun, referring to fallen holy messengers, Nephilim or outsiders as conceivable sources, yet they do concede to the qualities which can include higher than normal IQ, more touchy vision and different faculties, lower body temperature, higher circulatory strain, expanded event of clairvoyant, instinctive capacities, transcendently blue, green, or hazel eyes, red or ruddy hair, expanded affectability to warmth and daylight, can't be cloned. Additional vertebra. When you have completed the process of looking at yourself, on the off chance that you are rhesus negative you are as of now exceptionally uncommon as not very many, 15%, individuals fall inside that class. It's fascinating to take note of that the shading alluded to in these attributes are run of the mill of northern Europe, a resound of the biblical story of Noah's child being killed by the Nephilim and the youngsters delivered populating northern Europe maybe? Be that as it may, what does rhesus negative mean precisely? Of the human blood classifications, O is the most widely recognized. It is an all-inclusive blood classification. Blood classifications are additionally separated into two gatherings, negative and positive. This is known as the Rh factor. The Rh factor is the, rhesus as in monkey, blood factor. On the off chance that your blood tests positive for this you have the factor in your blood. In the event that you test negative, you don't have the factor in your blood. The Rh factor is a protein found in the human blood that is specifically connected to the rhesus monkey. At the point when blood classification is acquired from your folks, it is realized that this factor component of the blood is the most predictable human or creature trademark passed on to the offspring. There are very couple of variations. It wants in a while changes. A great many people, around 85%, have Rh constructive blood. That could bolster people developed or were gotten from primates. 15% of people have Rh contrary blood. On the off chance that blood classification would one say one is of minimum variable human trademark, where did the Rh negative originate from? This inquiry has perplexed researchers for quite a long time. There is some confirmation that recommends the Rh negative blood gathering may have showed up around 35,000 years prior. Also, the appearance was local and appeared to, initially, be associated with specific gatherings, clans of individuals. Northern Spain and southern France is the place you can discover a portion of the most elevated centralization of the Rh contrary factor in the Basque individuals. Another unique gathering were the Eastern, Oriental Jews. By and large, around 40 to 45 percent of Europeans have the Rh negative gathering. Just around 3 percent of African descendant and around 1 percent of Asian or Native American descendant has the Rh negative gathering. Because of the bigger European numbers, it is a sure thing that was the place it was brought into the human hereditary code. Could this likewise be the place the Caucasian was presented? Is the acquaintance of Caucasian related with the Rh blood factor? This would loan assurance that the Rh negative factor was presented from an outside source. Could the source be from human-like creatures from another planet? Or on the other hand possibly we are similarly as outsider as they seem to be, in that, we are a result of their control and impedance. Would they be able to have come here and controlled living things effectively introduce on earth to make current man? Numerous old writings, including, the Bible, do bolster this hypothesis. 
numerous stories in the old writings, particularly pre-Christian writings, do tell about a race that from the heavens to the earth came. In the Bible, man considered them to be divine beings, living long lives and performing supernatural occurrences. In the Book of Enoch, which never entirely made it formally into the Bible as it was viewed as worshipful and excessively worried about the tale of the blessed messengers, the Nephilim and fallen heavenly attendants are alluded to in detail. The book was composed by Enoch who was an extremely intriguing and imaginative biblical character. He was thought to be an indistinguishable chronicled figure from Abraham in the Talmud. It is trusted he was firmly associated with Archangel Metatron, who, despite the fact that he sounds more like a power ranger, is accepted to be the most noteworthy of the considerable number of archangels and the nearest to God. Some trust he is the blessed messenger who welcomes you at the profound extension amongst earth and paradise which in fact makes him the grim reaper. In Greek folklore he is viewed as what might as well be called Hades who took spirits over the sticks to the underworld, 